Diane from Teach Pre-K. Today I am headed into my classroom. I've got my sunglasses on my head. I've got a bunch of stuff in this office that I've got to load up into my car. Um, I'm going to start my classroom setup this year. And my plan for today and my goal for today is to get my furniture where I like it placed. It's pretty much the same every year. Um, and then I'm going to make some notes um, as to what I want to do for my second setup day, which will be tomorrow. Um, my handyman is going to come and going to fish some wires through the walls for me tomorrow. So I'm going to be back tomorrow and I just need to figure out what I'm going to do after the furniture is set. Um, I've got that sequin board. I need to find a place for that. I need to change where my magnet board is gonna go. I need to figure out a new place for color posters, for birthday posters. I've gotta figure out how I'm gonna do a linear calendar. There's so many things that I wanna implement this year. Um, I'll also be showing um, where I put a lot of my stuff um, that you can still get for $5 until Labor Day, like all my classroom stuff. And I'll be putting some more of that stuff out in subsequent videos so you'll be able to see how it all looks um, and works in action. So, I got a lot to do. Um, I'm looking forward to it. It is 10.45 right now. Hopefully, I'll be on the road at about 11 or 11.15. Um, I want to pack a little bag of snacks and get a good drink ready in my Stanley. And, yeah. I'm excited. I can't wait. Um, I also already have uh, some suggestions of what people wanted to add to my classroom decor set. Um, hopefully I'll put those in in the morning. I made two things today. This is super cute. Somebody is like, hey, can you make some season things for the calendar? Hello. Yeah, I don't know why I didn't think about that. And all those calendar numbers, this is what I did. She does a little pocket chart game with, I think her name is Debbie. She's adorable. Um, she does a little pocket chart game with letters where she hides like a little sticker and they have to find the letter and, you know, see if they can find the sticker. So she just wanted lowercase. I made upper and lowercase for every single month so that those will kind of all work together in circle time too. So great idea. And then somebody else says their kids sit on stools or benches on the rug, little short little bench guys. So um, I'm looking at changing, not completely, but adding to the rules on the rug, um, something about sitting on benches or stools. So I'm working on that. Hopefully that will be just another folder included in the zip file. Um, maybe, I, let's say Friday. I want to give myself some time. I also have to go see my mom and who knows what I'm going to do over there. But I'll see you in my classroom. Here it is in all its glory. These wires will be taken care of tomorrow. But here it is. My half carpeted walls. That's a pretend bulletin board. That's a real one. That's a real one. And here's all of my furniture. So my goal today is to set this up and then move all this furniture where it needs to be. There's my rug. It was supposed to be cleaned. The way it's rolled up is making me feel like it wasn't, so that might be something I have to do. But yeah, here I go. I'm excited to start. Okay, it is 11.50. Um, I'm gonna start and see just how long this takes me. I'm gonna film it and uh, we'll see what I have done when I'm through.
my big hand in the way. Um, it's 12.15 and I put all my furniture back where it needs to go. So that took me 25 minutes. So I'm going to do a little tour and show you what I've got going on and what I want to get done today. I'm going to bring some things in from my car. Um, so hopefully I don't want to stay here past one today. This is my first day. So that gives me just a little less than 45 minutes to bring everything in from my car and maybe hang up my magnet board and maybe my sequin board or maybe just take some things down that I know I'm not gonna use. Okay, so here it is done. You walk in and I've got cubbies on both sides. Uh, one's for preschool, one's for pre-K. Here is my water bottle trays, trash can, sensory bin. This is my art table, my art supply area, my drying rack. Here is my alphabet wall. I'm changing all these to the new ones that um, are available in my classroom set. They are landscape instead of portrait. Um, I'm gonna keep those center signs. That little thing that says right, I got it at Target a million years ago. Welcome came from Target. This is my writing center, my little writing center table, my math area with my number line, and I've got my old shape posters everywhere. I'm gonna take these down. Do you even have them down here? I'm gonna take them down today. Here's a half sheet center sign. I was thinking about using this bulletin board for birthdays and just making it longer, but it kind of encroaches on dramatic play. So I'm gonna see. Uh, here's my dramatic play area. My table is super rickety. I'm gonna get that fixed. Ooh, scary storage area. Uh, my block area, a lot of my block toys, you guys, I'm really lucky. I have all these super high shelves, which is helpful because the kids can't reach all these toys. So they learn not to take the things off of these shelves, but these, yay, don't even have to worry about it. Uh, puzzle shelves. Okay, here is gonna be my new home. On the back of this uh, puzzle shelf is gonna be my new home for my magnet board. My bookshelf, I'm gonna put those little cushions I got from Target here. Over here is going to be my iPad area. So see that lovely, horrible hole right there? I'll probably put some cute little sign or something up there. But these are my old color posters. Those are gonna be taken down and I'll put my new ones up. I don't know that I'm gonna put them here. Here are those half sheet or print full sheet connect uh, alphabet line. I will get their little names up there. Uh, my smart board, apparently I'm getting a different one so I won't have this projector or, oh look, the projector from the last smart board. Lordy, uh, hopefully I won't have that anymore. These are the awful cords that I am gonna have hidden tomorrow, yay. Um, I might make one of these my birthday boards. I usually put like kids art over here, calendar over here, but I'm thinking of doing a linear calendar and doing it low down there. Yeah, it might be disturbed by the kids, but you know what, it's a chance I'm willing to take. Here is my teacher cart with all my days of the week circle time stuff, extra centers, letter of the week, all that stuff. You guys, this is my teacher desk. This is it. It is probably uh, two feet by three feet, or let's say two and a half feet by two feet. It's the absolute worst. Um, I have these shelves underneath, and I purchased this chair, and I'm looking at my rug, and I know for sure from looking at it, that it they didn't wash it. I mean, the white is just dingy, so I'm gonna wash the rug, so that's gonna be one thing. I'm gonna bring my own carpet cleaner and do that. Um, here is my sink area, a bunch of trays. Favorite trays there. So this is it, you guys. Here's my literacy area, my weather chart, my job chart. I don't know where my visual schedule is. I had it but I'm gonna make these new. They are totally battered. I don't think I've replaced them for about five years. 
definitely pre-COVID, way pre-COVID. My air filter, so guys, I'm 25 minutes. Yeehaw. Okay, I'm gonna get everything from my car, bring it down and put a few more things out. Okay, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna show you what I got done and I'm out. Okay, so I brought in everything from my car and to kind of put it where I'm gonna use it. My new shape sign and my math center. Just some new things that I bought for the classroom. Literacy stuff and math stuff. I'm gonna mount the sequin board on the back of that bookshelf. I have a little table I'm gonna put there for iPads. My little seats. I'm gonna mount the magnet board. Already getting ready to put the names up on my alphabet line. And let's see what else. Uh, some calendar stuff over here in my circle time area, birthdays, some new signage. Got my placemat, stuff for school. This bulletin board is going to go because it got so damaged last year. I think I'm gonna change the paper on that one too. That one I'm gonna keep the same just because it has all the spots where I need to put signs. Um, I have some new borders. I've got my folders, my stickers, pencils, Velcro, a bunch of junk I needed to bring. Um, I did place their cubby name strips and their cubbies, how I'm going to have it. You can tell my purple class, my pre-K is really light. And I have a lot of three-year-olds. I will put out tomorrow their little backpack names too, out in the hallway. Not bad for the first day. The real work is coming up. But thanks so much for watching.